Annabelle from Maryland. Please like and subscribe. What's up guys, welcome to the video. Today we're reacting to MSA. Let's do it. Subscribe everyone. They throw me big birthday parties in our backyard and invite the whole Oh good. They're throwing birthday parties. Because my parents were kind and friendly. I look a lot like my mom. And I took my dad's curly hair, which I love. Oh yeah, so they're twins, like mom and dad, uh, dad and daughter. Hey Annabelle, how many birds live inside that nest on your head? Oh god. You have spiders coming out of your nose again. Oh, no, yeah. No, I don't. But I need to look. <laughs> yeah, they're like joking. It became popular after that. People thought I was funny. Yeah. She she looks like she's going to be a comedian, funny comedian. Subscribe everyone to reach 100 subscribers. All over the house and packing. Annabelle, go upstairs and take only your most important things. What? Are we going on holiday? <laughs> Annabelle, just go. I packed my favorite sweater, some gadgets. Good, she's going to Hollywood. But why is the teacher or her mom is strict? Why is her mom strict? Hours later, I what? woke up in a cabin deep in the woods. You know moms this day, these days. This is our new home. Huh? Yes. And tomorrow, you'll be starting a new day at your new school. What? I was so confused and angry. My parents had just... This is MSA, everyone. Make sure to watch oh, their channel. It's so good. And I left without saying goodbye. When I asked my parents why we moved so fast, they just said it was related to their work. Uh, and they're the joking, like, so day, her kid uh, don't know. You know, parents these days. Until one day in the seventh grade, Mom and I were in the grocery store when I spotted a man who kept looking at us. Mm -hmm. I tried ignoring it looks like a stalker. I saw making a call, and I heard those words. I found him. Mom, see that man in black? He's been following us. Her face went pale. And suddenly, she took my hand and ran out the door. I saw the man chase us, but we managed to escape. And that night, we had to move again. Oh, Are God. Moving, moving, moving. Moving, moving. The kind of work we do, it makes us special. What do you mean? We're like undercover detectives. But detectives are always out searching for things, and you two are always at home on your computers. Then we're computer detectives. I knew he was lying, which made me more frustrated. And my parents even told me not to become close friends with anyone now. I didn't see the point anyway, since we'd probably just move again. One day in 10th grade, I was putting stuff away in my locker when this pretty girl leaned against the wall and kept staring at me. Can I help you with something? Hi, I'm Leela, your neighbor. We just moved in next to you. I think you're mistaken. I don't have any neighbors. Uh, yes, you do. We moved into the old abandoned cabin. Oh, that place? I thought it was haunted. Well, the ghost of the haunted cabin would like to be your friend. I laughed, and we started hanging out after that day. I could guess from her worn-out shoes and bag that she wasn't well off. But she always knew who was wearing which brand and yeah. seemed to be really into fashion. She's intelligent on brands and fashion, you know. Fashion -er. One day at recess, I caught her looking at the necklace I was wearing, and I asked her if she'd like to try it on. How does it look? It's better on you than me. It really suits you. Keep it. Really? Oh, thank you so much. A few days later, we were walking home when I felt someone was following us. I turned around to see a really cute guy walking a few steps behind. Do you think that guy is stalking us? Oh, him? He's my brother, Kyle. Wow, he's cute. Not you too? Please, promise me that you'll never fall for my brother like the other girls. He's such a douchebag. I promised I'd ignore his existence. Which was hard because he was drop dead gorgeous. Oh yeah, drop dead gorgeous. You know what means drop dead gorgeous? Slang, you know. I'm not. I'm. I'm. Yeah. And we're also neighbors. Mom and Dad looked at each other, then pulled me. What means drop dead gorgeous, bro? He did it's his brother. Like, uh, what's wrong? Like. I am not moving anymore until you guys tell me what's going on. And this time, I want the truth. Don't treat me like a kid. Hello, my name's Omar. We are in witness protection. I testified against the mobsters when you were younger. And that's why we've been on the run ever since. What? So we're in danger? Oh, Mom, yes. Stay clear from people. Okay. We just can't trust anyone right now. My mind started... My sister is supposed to be dinner. next to me, but she quit being in this, re in this reaction video. I quietly crept to my parents' room, but it was empty. And I found the front door wide open. Mom? Dad? My heart was beating like crazy when suddenly Leela's brother walked in. What do you want? What did you do to my parents? Um, what? 
My dad's van got stuck in the mud and your parents are outside helping him. They sent me to get a crowbar? Oh, it's by the fireplace. I followed him outside and saw mom, dad, Leela, and her parents pushing the van. Once it was done, everyone came to our house for coffee. My parents didn't look so scared anymore, so I guessed we were staying. Just then, Leela sprung up and asked me if we could go to my room. And when we entered, she threw herself on my bed. Oh, your bed is so comfortable. Okay, don't you have one? No, I sleep on the couch and my stupid brother gets the bed because he's older than me. I knew they were poor, but I didn't know things were that bad. Why do you hate your brother so much? Because he gets everything. And my parents are always favoring him. Since Leela you have to be grateful, to me, like... I decided to open up to her, too. Your mom and dad should treat your brother and sister equally. Wow. So you Don't and judge are your mom and brother and sister. People? Yeah, you could say that. That is so cool. Just then, Kyle came to my door and said they were going home. You looked directly at me while I spoke okay. to him. Remember, guys, our reaction video comes every week, and we also make daily videos. Check out tomorrow and today's video. We're after this um, reacting reaction video. I'm gonna do another video. So this reaction is coming every week and Tuesday morning and night. We have a hooded figure caught on the security footage, and when I identify... And uh, we also do daily videos. Tomorrow we have crafting videos. It's so good. I already planned it. willing to consider another punishment. It was all anyone could talk about. Later that day, I was in the library trying to reach a book, when suddenly, Kyle appeared next to me and took it down. I mumbled a thank you. Guys, um, look, um, I'm gonna show you part two, okay? It's part one. Part two is coming.